Hello and thank you for watching this video. My name is Dave and I am your champion of culture. My website is DaveLosavio.com and together we are making 2018 our best year yet. My favorite coffee mug. You know what hasn't been in this for a week and two days? Coffee. Can you believe it? Uh, I love my bulletproof coffee in the morning, especially when I'm doing the intermittent fast and stop eating at 8 p.m. and don't eat again till noon the next day. That bulletproof coffee comes in handy. Well, guess what? No more. Not forever. I started off with a week. I might go another one, two, three weeks. And there is a reasoning behind this because I was listening to my body, which is the topic for today's video. Listening to that feeling and making slight adjustments. So I felt like I was drinking a little bit too much caffeine and it was kind of wearing me out a little bit. Um, I do drink a lot of water at the same time, um, so I didn't feel dehydrated. But I just felt like something was a little off. I said, you know what, how simple will it be just for me to cut out coffee, cut out the caffeine for a couple weeks? And let me tell you, it's been really, really awesome with the dream state. My dreams instantly became a lot more vivid and I'm remembering my dreams in the morning and they're very aligned with what's going on in my life. Certain things that have left my life, certain situations that have popped into my life and certain challenges I have coming up and maybe a little bit from the past too. So the dreams have been pretty wild the last week and couple days. Um, I think that's due to um, caffeine affects vitamin B is what I heard and vitamin B helps your dream state and Without the vitamin B in your system, your dream state goes down or you don't remember your dream. So whatever the reason is, the dreams are pretty vivid. So let's think of some times in our lives where um, we get that feeling in our gut or maybe in our back or it could be in the neck. We all have different areas where we feel out of alignment when someone is speaking about a topic or maybe they're not telling the full truth or maybe we feel like they're kind of taking advantage of us or maybe just out and out lying to us. We kind of get a feeling in a certain spot in our body. It's usually the same place every time. And uh, it's usually a sign. And the sign is that something's wrong and it's time to realign and it's time to shift. So maybe you could think of current times with a significant other in your life and there's something that you want to discuss with them. Uh, maybe it's with a family member that maybe takes advantage of you a little bit. Maybe it's a client. You know when you're on a sales call and the client's asking for a lot, um, which sometimes clients do, and um, you're just not feeling aligned with it. You kind of feel taken advantage of. Sometimes as a salesperson, we might even feel like we're showing a client a product that maybe isn't going to serve them to the highest level but at the same time gives us a little bit extra margin. Yeah, I kind of have that feeling on the inside, right? Like you know you're not doing something right. Yeah, that's that feeling. So the idea here is to be in tune with your body, whether it's a certain exercise that's just not working out for you well, maybe it's something that you're eating and you could feel it in your gut or you could feel it in your body or your stomach or your belly, uh, and maybe it's a relationship that you have with somebody that when there's a conversation going on, you just have that funny feeling inside and it's time for a change. So be in tune with your body, trust your gut, trust your feelings, go with them, and don't worry about what the other people think because You've got to do what's right for you first. I appreciate you watching this video. Thank you for your support. And I do appreciate all the comments. You could share below. You could like. You can give me some constructive criticism because you know feedback is the breakfast of champions. And until next time, borrow from your future self, align with your purpose, and up-level your impact.